today's Sunday. We are here for like a three, four day hunt. And there's nothing you can do on Sunday for hunting in Maine. So we're gonna do a little introduction of black powder. All right, so we're gonna load up the, the 44 Navy, uh, the 44 caliber 51 Navy. It's not really a historical piece. It's more of just a common reproduction that's available today. They were originally available only 36 cal. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use GoX real black powder. I'm gonna use 25 grains in this. So the way how you load this is you pour 25 grains in here, close this off, you put the gun on half cock, then you pour into one cylinder. There's multiple ways on how to load, but for today, I'm going to use Wonder Wads. You put that over your powder so it lubricates the barrel in the action. The, the action's already lubricated, and but, let's, and let's also show one up close, so people can get an idea of the the wad I'm here. I'm putting that wad down, <laughs> and I'm going to put 454 round ball, and the 440s, 454 right here. So I'm going to put that over there, over the, the chamber I loaded. Put this down, then I'm going to smash it in. And you can see there's a ring of lead because it's oversized, so it completely fills the chambers. That helps with the process of uh, the possibility of a chain fire because you get that ring of lead, so you know you get a pretty good seal. Some other people will do things like grease the cylinders, but the Wonder Wash worked pretty well. And that's basically how you load it. I'm going to load up four more because I'm going to put it down in an empty chamber, and then we're going to test fire it. So what you do is then I have this cap to help me put the percussion caps on. These are actually CCI number 11s. I pop them on the nipples, put it on. And sometimes they don't go on very well with this capper. Okay, so I have one of the nipples not covered, so I line up one, the last one that has it, and I pull the hammer back, and I put it down in an empty chamber. So some things to think about with, Col with Colts are one, they have all different points of impact depending on which ones you own, so you gotta really test them beforehand. But this one shoots pretty high, so I'm probably gonna aim about six inches below the pie plate I'm trying to shoot at to hit it in the center, okay? Below the very bottom of it. Uh -huh. and then some other things you have to think of, it's a single action, so you're going to cock it every time you're going to fire it. Yeah. Okay, and then there's also the possibility of a cap jam. So sometimes you'll pull the trigger and the cap will fall into the action and it won't detonate. Yeah. Okay, so you have to think about that stuff. If it doesn't detonate, just wait a second or two. If the cap didn't go off, okay, if the cap didn't go off, wait a second or two just in case it's a real slow fire. Uh -huh. But if the cap did go off, and it didn't discharge, you're gonna wait a little while longer. Okay? Yeah. So let's give it a go. I'm gonna I'm gonna pull the first thing and give it a go. I'm aiming about six inches below. Okay, so he's gonna try to load his first one. So you take, first thing you gotta do before you do this, pick up the pistol, pull the hammer back to half cock. Okay, that's where you need to be. Okay, so that frees a cylinder for you to move it. Okay, then you put it down, you just stand up like this. Okay, then you pick a cylinder to put your powder in. So this is already preset for 25 grains. I actually think it's a little less. I think I have for actually 22 grains. Pour it till it's full. Stick in a little bit. Okay. Oh. Then pick your cylinder. Wrong side. Gotta be on the oh, right side. Yeah, okay. See how it's got a loading gate? Yeah. Oh, so you're actually better off pointing at this one. Okay. Pour the whole thing in. 
And then we're using Wonder Wads, like I said before, put that in there. Hold on, use this to push it down. You can you can actually advance it to the cylinder too, and then use the loading lever to push oh, it down. Okay. You can. That works pretty well. And then don't move it and try to slide the ball in there. Something that doesn't really want to go though. Is it fitting on there in the right cylinder? Yep. Okay. Now pull that hammer down and load it. How hard do I push? Push. As far as you can go. Seems to be pretty done oh, to me. Yeah, it, it moved a little bit after yep. that. You have right to there. have the ball sitting on the powder. Oh, crazy. Because it could cause like a little bit of a, a gas problem. It can be a little explosive in there. So now how do I get the cylinder to go back in the other direction right you now? You don't have to go back in the other direction. You just keep on advancing forward. Okay, just go one, on, one at a time. Yep. So that's all we're going to do. I'm just showing you him loading one, and then we're going to move on. Okay. So I'm going to cap it for, for him. Put it on half cock. Oh, he's got a point of down range, truthfully. This is going to push the caps in a little bit. If you don't have the cap seated all the way, it seems like that's probably the most likely place to actually have a chain fire. Because when it flashes, the... It can flash to the it other can flash to the, It can flash to the other hole. Exactly. So... you got to make sure all of them are fitting right there's a spent cap in there from when i shot a few minutes ago okay so now they're all on there i'm just going to push them down a little bit make sure it's facing down range and i guess can't have my finger in front of the chamber when i'm doing it just in case it's that nice Setting them in, then I'm rotating it over, setting it down in the empty chamber. So once you go up to the firing line, right about here, and you straighten off the trigger. Now pull the hammer and you're ready to fire. Now put it forward, pull the trigger when you're ready. You hit the target, I think. Pointed down range. Good thing you noticed. But the spent cap would not have went off. Point it down range. Go. Okay, pull the cap, pull the hammer. Yep. You're doing better than I did. Smack dabs dead center, bud. That's some good shooting. Nice. Is that the last one? Yeah. You sure? Awesome. Well, they're all, they all look smooth. I wasn't certain. I don't see anything in the chamber, so it looks like you're done. How'd nice. you feel about shooting your first spy powder? That was awesome. <laughs> cool. Well, well done, man. <laughs> four out of five on the plate. That was awesome. Yeah, man. all right, let's go down range and check it out. But he got four in here. This is, that might even be two holes. I think you hit the same hole twice. Maybe, really? maybe, <laughs> but that's a wad hitting it. He shot pretty well. I'll I'm take pretty, it. Awesome. All right.